a lot of sunshine, a lot of this on the way. It is going to be a really nice day today with just a slight chance, just a slight chance for a pop-up shower this afternoon. I'll show you that coming up in just a bit. In the meantime, first alert live radar, the only live radar in Connecticut scanning dry visibility. No fog for the first time in a while. No fog to greet us this morning. We did have a couple of passing showers in the overnight. You can see them right here making their way from New York into northern Connecticut. So you might be waking up to a little bit of wet pavement up here in northern Connecticut, right along the notch in North Granby, right where Judy lives. You might be waking up to a little bit of wet pavement. But other than that, we are good to go. Again, the temperatures are in the mid 50s, if not 50. Uh, Putnam, you jump from 55 to 56. These are delightful numbers for this time of year. 58 is the typical overnight low. We've got that for you in Norwich and some lower 60s along the shoreline. That water temperature in the Long Island Sound is now 65. Still a little chilly, but at least it's moving in the right direction. We're basically down from where we were 24 hours ago, anywhere from 1 to 5 degrees. Not substantial, but we do want to bring to your attention, it is a fairly cool start out there, considering where we should be. Dew points, comfortable, low 50s. We're one away from the upper 40s in Torrington, which is just delightful out there. And according to our dew point trend, you're not going to see a rise too much until Friday when it's 90 degrees hazy hot and humid with a chance for afternoon showers and thunderstorms that'll drop the humidity and the, the uh, dew points back for the upcoming weekend the winds are calm this morning yeah four to five not a big deal basically calm and let's take a look at first alert future cast we dot the landscape at 2 p.m with a couple of specks of green that's a little indication that we could see a passing shower at 5 p.m there it is again but it's basically insignificant most towns stay dry there's just about a 10 percent chance of an opportunity for a scattered shower this afternoon. Tomorrow, a little bit better clouds, and then you'll see the green dots once again. But by 6 p.m., we're under mostly clear skies, and Wednesday looks mostly sunny. Just, wow, this is a frozen eye cam in stores. That is, that is clearly not working. But you know what? Maybe it's an indication of beautiful skies ahead, as maybe Dan Hurley stays in stores. You never know. Uh, this is a live eye cam. New Haven, good morning to you. Things look great there. Things look beautiful in Windsor Locks, 59 degrees, and let's roll out the bus. Kids, as, as our Caitlin Francis just said, this is one of the last weeks of school for you. Many kids are out of school after this week. Unbelievable. Temperatures today will be in the mid-70s, a great day for outdoor recess. Forecasted highs today in the mid-70s. Beautiful day, mostly sunny with a, just a chance for an isolated shower. And then here comes your seven-day forecast. 79 tomorrow. Gets warm. 86 on Wednesday, flirting with 90 on Thursday, hot with afternoon showers and evening showers and some thunderstorms. Maybe some could be strong. We're going to certainly keep an eye on that. That's as a cold front bake makes its way through. And then the upcoming weekend, 86 and 87, looks like a really nice warm Father's Day weekend with very little rain in the forecast. Now, it is only Monday. There's time to fine-tune that forecast. But for right now, it's looking nice and warm out there. And those overnight lows do come up. But get ready for some heat, but not today. Today's the coolest of the next seven. So enjoy today. 